is a community that likes to hold on to its history. And that's why one church congregation is choosing to restore a building instead of letting it fall apart. Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Espayat shows us how the church is keeping its doors open. For the last century, Zion Evangelical Lutheran Church has been a vital place of worship in Tamaqua. It's a rare building, uh, the structure, there aren't many like this in town. But over the years, the building, which is made of granite, limestone, and cement, has experienced wear and tear. The cement area is cracking and deteriorating. To have to take it down, it would be greatly missed in the community, yes. Instead of letting the building go, the congregation has been working to give it new life. Gothic architecture may not be as popular as it used to be, but this church is an iconic landmark to the community, so when restoring it, they would like to keep it as close to the original as possible. The nearly million dollar restoration project is broken into four phases. This side of the building on North Greenwood Street was rehabilitated during phase one, which started in 2017. They recently finished phase two, which repaired the Chime Tower on Mock Chunk Street. Congregation members and outside community members have had a hand in getting the restoration project in motion. We have gotten gifts from people who are not members of our congregation. And I believe that has occurred because of because of the iconic nature of our uh, of our church. The church has a capital campaign going on to finance the project. So far, it's raised about six hundred thousand dollars from people taking on five and ten year pledges, and they've received about a hundred thousand dollars in donations. But they still have a ways to go. In Schuylkill County, Rachel Espayat, Eyewitness News. Now, the next two phases in that project have not yet started. You can head to our website, pahomepage.com, if you'd like to learn some more information on how you can contribute to their efforts.